Allie, you delivered the uh, the big two run home run after uh, William Penn kind of charged back there in the seventh <laughs> inning. Crazy seventh inning there, but um, you know, walk me through that at bat that ends with you hitting that big two run home run. Well, at first it just it felt really good to know my coach had that confidence in me to know that you know I could hit something like that and help produce for my team. And you know, we've always talked about me sitting and hitting, let that ball travel deep, and those words just really you know stepped in my brain and. Learning from my prior at bats and seeing other girls kind of struggle with being too early, you know, I really focused in on that ball and was like, it's got to be my pitch, let that come in deep, and more so doing this for my team instead of myself, you know, knowing what I had to do to produce my team to get us through that seventh inning to win that game. Do you feel like the girls were able to, you know, get get into, you know, a rhythm of what of what that William Penn pitcher was kind of dealing there in that second game? Because it seemed like for a while there she was able to kind of stifle a little bit here and there. Do, do you feel like the girls were able to find the rhythm at the right time? Yeah, you know, we uh, usually do a really good job communicating to each other about what the pitcher's doing, what we're seeing the ball, her speed, and we all did that a great job doing that in the dugout, but, you know, we don't really do well with slow pitchers. I think that's our biggest struggle because we usually hit off of our pitchers, you know, for practice, and they're incredible. I mean, we've seen it here firsthand. They can move the ball. They have speed. So, you know, trying to step back and let that ball travel in deep is our biggest struggle, and we're slowly working on that and getting better. And I think as the game proceeded on, we did a great job adjusting to that pitcher. And speaking of confidence in, in the batter's box, um, you know, what what did you think of you know Gabe stepping up and getting that big uh, game winner hit to to finally seal the deal there? You know I knew she had it. She's always she's one of those girls that you know she doesn't think she doesn't overthink stuff. She has confidence in herself. She knows she can do stuff. And you know we all we all have that moment. We all we all believe in ourselves and we believe in our coach and you know just trusting ourselves and our team to do produce runs. We we really work on that and strive for the best. And defensively overall, how did, how did you feel about what the girls were able to put together defensively? Seemed, you know, uh, a couple slip-ups here and there, but overall it seemed like a pretty strong day. Oh, for sure. You know, we all have our weak points here and there, but we're doing a great job of if we do mess up, getting back. And instead of getting angry and upset with ourselves, we get angry and we want to step up and we want the ball hit to us again to show what we're capable of capable of and that's what we continue to do and you know every game we're growing from there and I think it's just a great team that we have and we're always getting better we're always wanting to get better. Is that going to be the big focus of this homestand is just kind of being able to settle down after you know some of the you know the fun trips down to Florida well the fun you know business trips yes. down to Florida so to speak is that going to be kind of the key is getting settled in and being able to you know, find that confidence game after yeah. game. Yeah, you know, in Florida, it was it was carefree. It was Florida. We were like, it's a great weather. Let's just have fun. And I think here we got a little stressed because it's our first home game. It's our last first home game of right. our season because exactly. of, you know, sadly with our program. But, you know, I think we all have that jitters of wanting to prove what we have. And I think as we proceed the season, we'll get back into that comfortable state where we are in Florida because we're not loose and we just have fun and we love the game and we express our love and just, you know, play carefree. That's when we play our best. And I think as we progress on, we'll do much better with that.